Hey, what's up, y'all? And welcome back to another three horror games video. Today, the first game, we starting up with Little Jimmy's Gift. I really don't want to know what the hell Little Jimmy's Gift is, but let's go ahead and start this video up. It's it's 1.30 a.m., and Little Jimmy has been awakened. He can't he can't sleep due to, to, due to the excitement of using his new camera his parents gave him. Hey, listen, I've been there. You end up getting new, you, you, your parents get you something new, you, you get excited, but at 1.30, you gotta go to bed. It, it's 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 morals, but at the same time, you got monsters and you don't wanna be upsetting the monsters, bro. And my thing is, who sleep like that? Who sleep on their back with no cover on them? You crazy. I mean, the game feel good, but yeah. Who sleep like that? You crazy. And why it's so dark? You got a light? Well, I got a camera. I hope your camera got night vision. Oh, no. It's one of these games. And then it's still photos. Nah, hummy. Nah, hummy. So what are we doing? I hate that. You know why I hate it? Cause like I said, it's still photos. It's one of them things where I thought my, I thought the game froze up, but it, it it ain't freeze up. So what they? I mean, you could zoom. Hey, little Jimmy, up here in the closet. Who? Huh? Excuse me, black hand. Hello, I'm Maria, your guardian angel, and I'm here to protect you. Listen, Maria, we all know you lying. So why don't you? But you don't look like an angel. I don't even know what the hell it looked like. I'm looking at the closet. And then the, the 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 dialogue all over the place. It's all over each other. They trying every every word trying to get in spotlight. You want me to leave the damn house? Little Jimmy tiptoed into his parents' room, grabbed a flashlight, and headed outside. He wandered into the nearby woods, discovering himself surrounded by nature's embrace. Man, already, y'all. This game. I'm not even gonna say it yet. I'm not gonna say it yet. I'm gonna wait. I go, wait, why they ain't just show me the thing? I'm over there. It said, look up in the closet. I'm looking at the closet. It's only one big-ass closet in the room with me. And now this little boy about to go get killed because some guardian. This is why kids stupid. This See, kids be acting like they got it all figured out. It's like, girl, I don't need, I'm not a baby, you know. But listen, you get put in a situation like this, kid, you probably going to die. That's what set them apart from adults. Listen, it's some dumb adults out here. Maria, where are you? I'm scared. Oh, it's too late. Maria got you by the butt cheeks. It's it, it's it's too late, Jimmy. Jimmy, whatever your little gift is, I think you about to get it. Because that girl is about, that thing is about to straight up get you, doll. Yep, it's about to get you. What the hell? Why? I gotta go in that? Oh no, Jimmy. Jimmy. Little Jimmy then entered an old underground basement in the woods looking for Maria. Maria about to get you. This, this the type of stuff. See, these demons and stuff be preying on the dumb kids. It's some innocent, smart kids out there with a little sense if they raise right. But no. This, this little boy right here has to be the stupid one. He's got to be. His name is Jimmy. He's stupid. Yeah. You know what I hate? That flashlight. It's it's a few things I hate about this game. Well, I don't like about this game. And that flashlight, one of them. Because it's retarded. It's not, it's not, you know, it's not the typical flashlight where you, where it's aimed with the camera. It's like its own thing. If it go far enough to the left or right, that's when the camera turns. Kind of weird. I don't like it. They could have did better with that. I really hate that shit. Because I'm serious. You about to die. As long as you give me a good thumbnail, Maria, we'll, be, we'll get somewhere. Because I, I can't even run either. This is as fast as he go. I understand. Because if it was me, well, shit, if it was me, I'd still be at the house. I, I wouldn't even be here. I wouldn't even give myself time to think about wanting to be here. It, it, it'll never happen. Step would never find his ass here. I would never come here. 
Never. Even as a kid, I was always told to get my ass away from strangers. And if a stranger ever, if a, a stranger called Maria ever tried to finesse me to get, you know, to 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 come hang with them, I'd be like, bro, you. Weeks later, the authorities discovered the basement and found the body of a child with his stomach cut open and missing some organs. Well, listen, I appreciate the message for the kids, but listen, these kids today so damn short-tempered and short-tempered and short attention span. They gonna do what they wanna do. I'm not saying all them kids dumb and like that but there's some dumb ass kids out here so yeah that's it for little jimmy's gift that game was dumb that game was so dumb i you know and it don't even surprise me one it don't surprise me and two i'm not even mad because sometimes you gotta come well sometimes i gotta come across one of these little stupid games the camera was so dumb like when the game started up it felt good the movement was good i liked it but then that's when the 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 the, the dislike started, cause then the dialogue. I'm in the room trying to figure out what I gotta do, and I can't go outside. You know what I'm saying? I got my camera. I picked up the camera. But then that's when the thing started talking to me, and it's like, hey, up here in the closet, and I'm over there looking at the closet, taking pictures, and it ain't nothing. It's just a box. Maybe they not showing it to me. Maybe it's in the closet, so I can't see it. But then that's when Jimmy was like, you don't look like a, 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 a fairy or whatever it was. And then I'm like, so they, they was lazy. They was too lazy. I get it. It was a short game. They probably made it for a jam, but that's no excuse to sit there and put out a short. I'd rather miss a jam and just put out a game. Take my time with it and then put it out. So I'm guessing they, they just rushed it. You feel me? But you ain't even have time to sit there or take time to, you know, design a a, a a a model for that monster make it look nice or make it like blur it out a little bit or have it in the closet and it's dark and i can see the eyes and maybe a little bit of the mouth and then it's like jimmy saying you don't look like a damn fairy you know and yeah and then how about that and then the camera was so dumb because you take a picture it ain't like the, i think the one game that come to mind is visage in that game you got a camera it's, it's a good camera you take and it's just like that a flash camera so you take a picture and it flash but the difference between this and visage is in this game when you take a picture it look like the game froze but that's not what it is that's just the way the camera work which i think is retarded if it's a flash it should be a seamless flash it shouldn't be no still photo back to the game and like in visage when you take a picture it's it's all happening at once you take a picture and you still moving within the flash i think the story was retarded it's like this little boy and then oh man the ending the ending is what made it worse the animated just an explosion of poopy he got a camera on his birthday whatever his damn i guess that's his little gift the 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 the, the camera so he wake up and he just excited to use it and for some reason he sleep with no cover on him which i think is dumb who sleep like that who sleep on their back with no cover on them in the dark i don't even sleep like that i can't sleep like that it's impossible for me to sleep like that but then this thing convinced him to go to the woods to play and then for some crazy reason he find this damn basement out in the middle of nowhere he go in there and he walking and then all of a sudden he find this little hatch up top and before he get to it some dude behind him i think that was one of the dumbest setups for a kid dying it was so retarded. Some dude, like he he got a picture off, and it ain't nothing but the pants and a little bit of up top. You know, pretty much everything except his head. That's dumb. If you was going to do that, a still photo at the end on some like Blair Witch shit or whatever you want to call it, like had him turn around real fast, get a quick picture off, and it's a blurred vision, like a real fast picture of a monster. I mean the face, the features and everything, but it's real blurred. So as to not give off exactly what it looked like, but you giving enough to understand like, hey, Maria wasn't a fairy. Maria wasn't good. She was some 
hungry demon that wanted to kill this little boy. But no, they went with the typical, hey, I'm a little fairy. And then when you get out there, it's a grown ass man. If, if you was going to do that, you should have made it a, a, a game where Jimmy was home by himself. And it wasn't late night like that. It was probably about 9 o'clock. And some dude knocking at the door. Some dude knocking on the door trying to, you know, convince Jimmy to let him in. And maybe Jimmy did let him in. Maybe, you know, he was saying he had snacks and stuff like that. And Jimmy did let him in. It took a while. I don't know. Like, to see, the in-between is not my problem. That's the dev problem. And then the last thing, the flashlight, it was so, so weird. It wasn't like most FPS games where you control the light with the camera and it's all going at the same time. No, the camera, the light got more movement than the camera. So if you, so the, the, the light got to reach a certain point before the camera start turning with it. It might seem like it's going all at the same time, but it's not. It's weird and I hate that. I done played a few games, like especially point and click games where they do that, where you got to, the light move, and then once it hit the edge of the screen, then the camera start turning. That's not what this game doing, but it's almost there, and I hate that. So this game is called The Other Side. Yeah, so this, I think this is supposed to be real short. Probably as short as the little Jimmy's gift. It look good. Well, I mean, it look real old PS1 style. I'm so hungry. Let's see what I have in the kitchen. Hey, screw the kitchen. Let's see what you got on the floor. You got a whole pizza slice on the floor. Let's just eat that. It look good. I'll eat that. Straight up. Ten, ten minute rule. Ten minute rule. Get the keys, pick up trash, go outside, get some food. Why, why go outside and get food when I have it on my floor in here? You know, how about that? How about that? It say get the keys, get the keys, get the keys, pick up trash. Get the keys, pick up trash. And how you going to tell me to go in the kitchen and get some food when you ain't even trying to eat? I'm clicking on everything. It ain't nothing happening. And why your house so dirty or your apartment so dirty? Did you have a party in here by yourself? It's kind of weird, bro. It's kind of weird. So them the keys. Give me them keys. Give me them keys, boy. So now we got to pick up the trash. I would eat that. I'm dead. So I would have ate that. I would have put it in my pocket and I would have ate it. He ain't even got a microwave. Well, then again, you don't need microwave when you got an oven because I don't even use the microwave. The only time I use a microwave ever, I'm dead serious, is if I'm melting butter in, in a bowl and I need it for something. Other than that, I, I never use the microwave to heat up my food. It, if, it's, if it ain't the air fryer or the oven, I'm not using it, straight up. You got to be, you know, you, you got you to gotta get away from that crutch cooking. That's what I call it, crutch cooking. Well, we got all the trash. We took all that trash and we made a trash bag. Didn't y'all know trash bags was made of trash? It's a bag made of trash, that's what it is. He said he wanted he wanted food in here. That's what he said, he said that. Y'all saw him say that. See, this is why devs need to take the time to make their game. Who the hell is that? Oh, I thought I saw somebody, that's a bush. Yeah, these devs need to make their games make sense and stop being so damn in impatient. Because that's pretty much what it is. Dude, dead ass, whoever made this game was so damn impatient. They tried. They was like, hey, let's get some food and see what I got in here. And, and that ain't even what you, I should get to my car and drive to some burger joint. Yeah, but which one of these your car? And then it's too damn dark. Wrong car. Ooh. Shit, it won't start. Maybe my neighbor Mac can help. I should go back. It's too damn dark. Why they ain't give me a flashlight? You got a better chance of scaring me with a flashlight than without a flashlight. Matt should be home. Maybe look around, knock on some doors. Well, wait, who the hell is missing? Is that Matt? That might be Matt. And how did, see, and it's like, maybe I should go find Matt. Let's knock on some doors. How about label the doors with numbers on them and then tell me exactly what floor he stay on if I gotta go on floors. Before going upstairs, I should check all the doors. Oh, that ain't mad. That's not mad. That's not mad, see? Fuck, a stranger's in the building. what that mean? Take out gun. Take out gun? what that mean? What the hell that mean? Oh my God. Boom. Wait. Hey, yo. Yo. 
Hello? What's up with people making these little shit games, dude? First off, it was confusing. Because dude said, I'm hungry. Let's go see what I got in the kitchen. I go in the kitchen, a piece of paper talking about, grab the keys, get the trash, go outside, find some food. So I grabbed the keys, start picking up the trash. I picked up a nice slice of pizza I could have ate. Then he like, hey, I gotta go. I gotta go outside and take the trash out. Then I gotta go see if I can find a burger joint. Why set up? See, it's the little things. It might not mean a lot to some people. It's like, what's the big deal? You know, things happen. But no, that's the point. If you're gonna be making games, take your time. Everything gotta make sense. The dialogue, the interaction with the characters and other characters in the environment. Everything gotta make sense. This game may make no sense. Then I go outside. I ch and, and see, and you know what it is. It ain't no structure to this game. You got to choose things to figure out what's right. You feel me? Like, go outside, find which car is yours. So you got to be clicking on random cars. At that point, you should only have one car out there, which was mine. Then the shit don't even work. It ain't work, so I had to go back in the building and find Matt, who I'm guessing is an electrician or whatever the hell, or he work on cars. So I had to go back in there, then it's like, Let's let's knock on all these doors and see which one is Matt. Instead of having them labeled and just having one specific door, you know, all of a sudden a dude in the building and he spawned behind me around the corner. And it's like, quick, let me get my gun out. So you just shooting somebody without knowing who they is. You don't know his motive. I ain't even see a weapon on him. He ain't had blood on him. So what's the deal? So then I just shoot him, and then I ain't even shoot him. I was pressing left click the whole time. As soon as I aimed, as soon as the as soon as the gun aimed at him, I was locked on target. I shot, but it ain't shoot. You gotta walk up on them, and then they automatically shoot. If you gonna give me a gun in the game, let me shoot. Don't sit there and crutch me and make it automatic some scripted stuff. Let me shoot. And then the end, the end is what take the cake like the first game. You in your apartment. You check the door because somebody knocked. And then it's a killer at the door. Like, for what? And then they end it right there. What did it even mean? What did the game mean with any of that? I'm really starting to question. Actually, I've been questioning the, the state of gaming. Because it ain't all these games. But I've been noticing that. You know how a lot of these, well, some of these AAA companies starting to get real lazy with their games. They 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 charging 70 bucks for a half-ass game and they come out with patches over the months and, and DLC. $70 for a game, $60 for a game, and then they charging you 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 bucks for DLC. They making a profit like crazy. But the most important takeaway from it is that they being real lazy with making the game. And I noticed that starting to bleed into the way these indie devs making their game. This was a free game. I understand that. But it's not the fact that it's free. It's the fact that it's a game made by somebody that's independent. And it was real lazy. You know what I'm saying? And then the only excuse some of these people can make is, well, I made it for a jam. You know? And it's like, well, you feel me? Like I, I, like I said in the first game, I'd rather miss that deadline and just make a game take my time with it especially if it's my first game take your time it might come out shit anyway but take your time with it make it good make it work work out as many bugs as you can and then put it out some of these people be trying too hard to put out a game to meet a deadline or to just get it out there it's like hey i made a game let me hurry up and rush it and get it out there so i could just get it out it's like take your time because neither one of these games so far made sense. So, yeah, I played the first game. Let me look at these controls. It's pretty much... I can run? Why? Why can I run? So, yeah, it's pretty much going to be the same thing as the first game, I think. It could be so different, but let's go ahead and get it. In normal, you're given a notepad to help keep track of things. Let's do normal. I'm not trying to do tough. I'm not tough. I'm not... I'm not tough. I'm not tough. Hey, it's Mama again. Hey, Junior. Hey, Mom. Damn, how long ago? How long was this? 
in the first game, he was legit. Like, he was real young. I'd probably say he was like six. Now you like 21. Is everything all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I had a few minutes left to spare before my break's over. Well, you know, I guess the good thing about this is at least we ain't got to worry about taking care of some kid. Because in the first game, you had to hide him and take care of him while trying to hide and, and block things. So it's probably going to be real different. So I figured I'd give you two, you two a call just to check in, you know? Well, who the hell is you two? I found a few extra dollars in my purse, so we ordered some takeout. Shouldn't take too much longer to get here, I reckon. I'm guessing Junior got a kid. Awesome, awesome. Y'all two enjoy. I better get in off. I better get on off this phone and get back to work then. Man. man, we got a bunch of stuff to move out of here tonight, and it's my turn to drive the forklift. If you know what I'm saying, Ma. Tell little Miss I said hello, would you? Will do, hon. Thanks, Ma. We'll talk later. You got to do it with the teeth. We'll talk. Thanks, Ma. We'll talk later. I can't do it. It's, it's hard. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes sometimes it's hard to talk with your, with your teeth. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Grandma. Hey, your papa says hello. He's still at work, so we still got to take care of a damn kid. He called during his break. Now, did you finish that homework of yours yet? Yeah, I did, Grandma. Good. That's what I like to hear. Oh, well, here you go. Oh, that's probably the food. I'll get it. Hey, little boy. You about to experience something your dad experienced a long time ago. Yep. 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 Yep, this way it start. Oh, no. Oh, my stars. Here we go again. Audrey, he's back. It's like she said so nonchalant. It's like, he's back. Here we go. We got to do this game. You, you know what to do, right? The man? Uh-huh. He sure is annoying, ain't he? Isn't he, hon? I don't want you to miss speaking up. I don't want you speaking up English like Grandma does. Yes, he is. I can't speak my teeth like I can't speak my teeth. You know what I'm saying? I, can't, I, I just can't speak my teeth. We're going to go through the book together this time, okay? And I want you to pay attention, close attention, Audrey. Your papa and I ain't all, I can't speak like that. And I ain't always here. So you need to know how to do this for yourself. I understand, Grandma, I think. Time will pass. The seasons may change. We know that nothing can ever stay the same. But still, the man continues to play his twisted game. For the simplest of requests is all he's ever wanted. In his unending search, these dark streets he's haunted. Once night falls, you'll know he's on the prowl. Keep far away, else you'll meet a fate that's assuredly most foul. A f may tapping at one's window has always been his herald. So spend these next five minutes wisely, or you may find yourself suddenly in peril. Now proceed with caution and proceed with haste, for the man has learned that there's no time to waste. The rest of the pages has been torn out. So what the deal is? Whoa, look at them tick old bitties. So is it gonna be like, it's our kitchen closet. That's cool. But I mean, you know. Oh, I gotta find the I gotta find the pages. Well, that's four. Uh, I see what they want me to do. It's our closet hemp. Yeah, I see what they want me to do. So I'm guessing the I guess the page is gonna help me figure out what need to be done and stuff and, and stuff. There ought to be one more page right here somewhere. Well, shoot. I thought that was it, but obviously not. So it's gotta be another piece of paper around here. Bro, that scared the shit out of me. I ain't know what it was. I, I about died. The free, oh, so you could cross things out. That's kinda cool. And then Audrey has don't wanna help me. Fucking lazy kids. Kids can't even, can't even get up and, and help. Help their damn grandma find a piece of paper. It can't be out here. It is. Wow. Well, had to do that. That's kind of dangerous. That's kind of dangerous, dude. Now, let's see. One, not many things. I like how they number them. Not many things can stop the man, neither force nor containment. Now he'll look under the box, watch for entertainment. So he look under the box. The man remains vigilant his hopes tonight. His next course of action is to look in the place where clothes are washed. So the laundry room. So he look under the TV, the laundry room. He'll now search the place reserved for bathing. Next, he'll check under the place where you sleep. So he'll check the bed, 
The next place to check is the sink with a cabinet on it. Soon he'll look in a place where food is stored. This? No, that's the closet. He'll look in the laundry room, which, no, that ain't it. That, I think. Or one of them. And, no, this probably, I don't know. It, it's hard to say. It's hard to say. Food is stored. I'm going to do that. He can hide in the damn fridge. It's the fridge. Audrey can hide in there a bit if she needs to. Yeah, I might have a hide in there. Oh, you locked that. I forgot that was a thing. You could lock it. Kind of save you some time. They ain't got keys in this game. It's so many different beds, too. Well, it ain't too many beds. She's hidden under here before. Wait, can I tell her to come with me? Yeah, bring your ass with me. Yeah, Grandma? Follow me. God damn it. Yeah. You get your ass over here. I'm going to have you hide in the damn sink. It's the kitchen cabinet. Yeah, hide under there. It's probably going to be a bad idea. But, you know, it is what it is. So she hiding under there. I, 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 I locked that. Can you turn the light off? No. It's nice having an actual bath. I can hide it if I want to. Don't hide yet. Because I got to figure out if he if he actually going to check the bathroom. Because I don't think it says something about checking the bathroom. Anything reserved for bathing. See, it say bathing. But it ain't say nothing about the shower. Because that's bathing. Oh, wash tub. See? It's only used to wash. Oh, that's for washing clothes. Where food is stored. That's the fridge. But she can't hide in there. She can't hide in there. It's the fridge. Nope, ain't fitting in there. Yeah, you, you damn right you ain't fitting in there, mama. Uh, wait a minute. What, what was bathing again? Oh, fuck. Well, she did. It was exactly 8 p.m. when the man approached the entrance door. Mom gonna be right in the open. And though he only had five minutes to accomplish it. Hey, you know what? I'm glad I'm dying because this would be a good learning experience for me. This time the man was ready. Yeah, I bet. Ooh, shit, he fast. The man had finally found his new friend. Hmm, this kind of shit. Hey, Mom, why is the front door wide open? Hello? Audrey? What the hell's going on here? Huh? Audrey, what happened? And where's your grandma at? Audrey, come on, I need you to talk to me. Was it? It was him, wasn't it? That damn man in the mask. That damn man from the window. He's out here taking my mama again. I'm gonna get his ass and stuff. I'm gonna get him and stuff. So yeah, you know what? So he just, he just busts right through it, huh? That's what she said. <laughs> I think the papers might be random. Yeah, they random as hell. Oh my God, this, well, this gonna suck. That's four and then five. That's it. That's all the pieces of paper. I'm actually surprised nothing happened when you out here. Hey, I wonder if it's a place to hide. Nah, it can't be. That'd be cheating, right? That'd be cheating. It's locked that. Yeah, you could, you you know, in the first game, you could move the couch. So, like, how you stop him from busting through the door? Smile and edit it. The next place he'll check is the sink with a cabinet underneath, under the place where you sleep. So, he'll check the sink cabinet, the bed. He'll check the fridge. He'll check under the, the TV. He'll check the bathtub, what well, the shower. And then he'll check the place under the mirror. So, what I'm going to do... The, the the place under the mirror. He not checking the bathtub, though. He not checking that. Nope. Hey, yo, we about to beat this. Bring your ass with me. We gonna do this. Follow me, young kid. Hey, you follow me, y'all get your ass. So, yeah, we gonna, we gonna do this. I'm, I'm gonna hide in there. I'm gonna have this kid hide in this. Yeah. Hey, it, it's either gonna work out or it's not. Let's do this. I'm ready. Yeah, you hide your big ass in there, mommy. Mommy Sweetums. It was exactly. Yeah, let's do this. I'm ready. I, he either going to find me or he not. Oh, I should have closed the doors in the rooms. Because now they're in there. Who's it here? I'm going to get your ass. And since the man had been left open, he knew exactly where to look. So the blinds had been left. Oh, no. Oh, that's cheap. Oh, that's cheap. That's cheap. 
I didn't know that was a thing. Oh, I could have had that. I was in a rush. The time was exactly midnight when Junior received an unexpected call. From the other side of the phone, emitted a series of distorted and indiscernible sounds, and after a few moments, the line went dead. Knowing full well that something was amiss, Junior immediately rushed home. What would he find upon his return? Only time would tell. Oh, that's some poop. I think that's our poop. Wow, I had that, bro. I was so, see, I got carried away with success that I overlooked the steps to get there. Because of everything. I forgot that was a thing. That's why them blinds there, because he peeking. He peeky weeky. So it ain't nothing in here. Anything? Can you interact with the mirror, the light, anything? It's the bathroom sink. Nah, I'm not doing that. Yeah, let's go ahead and close that. I'm going to close all the doors until I figure out what we got to do. Follow me. He not checking the bathtub, and he not checking. He not checking under the bed. Reserved for bathing and clothes under the place where you sleep. He not checking the fridge. He not checking. Audrey, get your ass in there now. Stuff in there. You stuff in there and get cold. Yeah, and then I'm going to close that. Can you lock him? Nah, why would you lock him? And then we gonna close that, close that, and then I'ma hide my ad right here. Yep. Yeah, let's do it. I either get caught or I don't. No, it's raining in the game. It's been raining lately and sometimes I get confused when I got my headphones on. Or is it raining? No, it's, it's raining in the game. He looked in the bathtub and nobody was there cause we a boss. But he found nothing. Yeah, you ain't gonna find nothing, dog. You ain't gonna find nothing. And I looked in the clothes hamper. And he ain't find nothing. You ain't gonna find nothing, dog. Oh, what's that? You looking under the bed, too? The man looked under the bed. What if it's like round two? Then he gonna switch it up, but he found nothing. You ain't gonna find shit, boy. Oh, you looking under the TV, too? You ain't gonna find shit, dog. Oh, what's that? You looking in the closet? You looking in the kitchen closet? But you ain't find nothing. The closet again. But you ain't find nothing, dog. You ain't find shit. It was the oh eight oh two. And though he still had plenty of time, left the man had run out of place to search. So as quickly as he arrived, he left. Sweet. At least he respect the game, you know. He ain't cheat. He ain't sit there and say, well, you know, we still got some extra places to check. I still think he going to come back, though. Or maybe not. Hey, Mom, I would have locked that, barricaded it, boarded it up, leveled it up to, like, maybe six. You know, Yeah, and stay gone this time. Don't you think you can just run in here and mess with Grandma and see me? Because I, I, I bop you one. I think he back, y'all. Now you gonna run away after all that shit you were talking, young son. What's that? Oh, that's the fool. Audrey, honey, you don't need to be scared. It's just the fool. What if he in that? What if he in that? Audrey? What am I gonna do with that child? So that was it? Wow, that was short-lived. You know what it is, though? It wasn't like the... Oh... It is raining outside. I thought it was raining. Because, like, when I take the headphones off, it's this microphone. This microphone's sensitive as hell, and I love it. But, yeah, this game was so much shorter than the first game, which is somewhat disappointing. But at the same time, I'm cool with it. Because in the first game, it wasn't. It was only so many places you could check. But the speed up time in that game, you had to barricade. Like I said, barricade the, you had to barricade the front door. You had to lock it. But then you had to block it with the couch which I'm surprised they ain't have in this game, considering he just rushed through the door. And then you had other things you could do in the first game, like you had a box of donuts, and you could feed him. You know, like, you either feed Junior when he was a kid, you either feed him some donuts, or you feed the man by opening the box, and I guess that speed up time. Lock doors in the house, like you could lock other doors other than the first one. You could lock the hallway, you know, the bedroom, the bathroom. You could lock other ones, and that'll take up time. You know, I'm pretty sure he'll get in the room, you feel me, like he'll bust in there anyway. But yeah, in this game, it was so much easier. It was like they crushed it, and I ain't like that. I wish they would have, 
I wish they would have expanded on the the idea of what this game was going with. Like, you know, it was a, a hiding game where you had to, you know, play. You pretty much play in chess against a crazy man. But I think it was real lazy on their part. Like, you could have you could have made it a more real-time hiding game and have him as an active threat. You feel me? Like, make it scarier. It was so – this, this could have been the first game and the second game could have been, you know, like a, a prequel. You feel me? Like a, a first – like, what – where did he come from? You know what I'm saying? But this this was so lazy. It's like you got to find the pieces of paper, which I don't even think the pieces of paper you find in the papers was wasting time. I think it's when you when you find them, then the time start going. Then you got to hurry up and figure out what it is you got to do and where you got to hide. But they give you so many more hiding spots. It's more hiding spots than it is for him to look. And it's I think it was kind of lazy. That's why I was saying, what if they got a round two? You feel me? But it ain't too many play it ain't too many ways you could, you know, waste time in this game is what I'm trying to say. When he came in the apartment and he was looking around, he only spent two minutes in there. Then they was like, Well, even though he got three minutes left, he didn't have too many other hiding spots to check. And that's where the game threw me off, because I'm thinking to myself, Well, why didn't they give him extra time to check other hiding spots? You feel me? And that's where the other features come in in this game where you had to, you know, do other things that I didn't find out yet to waste time, to waste the last three minutes. They ain't have nothing in this game. It's 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 other hiding spots in this game where you can hide and you safe because it's not places he checking. And then if he don't check them, then that's just it. You won. But that was lazy. You know, I was thinking they was going to at least extend them for another minute or two to, you feel me, look around in the spots maybe we was and then like it's like oh well you should have did this if you wanted to you know waste time and stuff like that but nah they ain't do that it was so lazy and i'm disappointed this three horror games was real disappointing all these games was disappointing i think out of all of them it ain't saying much my favorite was obviously the man from the window that's, that's it. it is what it is the mother two games was whack so if y'all want to try them, I'm going to leave a link for all three of these games. Y'all let me know what's up. Let me know what y'all thought about this. If you want to see the three horror games playlist, I'll drop a link for that. And thanks for watching.